Welcome back to Let's Play Rise, Son of Rome. We now pick up right where we left off. I've only ever known one man who can fight like that. Let us finish what your father started, Marius. Quickly, we need to get out of here. Senate is nothing but frightened old men. They no longer listen to truth nor reason. I warned them about Britannia, but to no avail. Commodus has held the legions back, doing nothing, whilst the massive barbarian army has swarmed across the empire, wreaking havoc as it closes in on Rome. The Britain, yes. And their army has grown tenfold. Everyone who opposes Rome has allied with them. Even tribes from faraway lands have sent them massive beasts of war. The Emperor and Commodus have made enemies. So many enemies. And across the Empire, these barbarians have seen how weakened we have become under Nero's rule. Mean to destroy us. Destroy the Empire. With Commodus gone, they'll ask me to assume command. And I'll need my best men if we're going to hold Rome. When I suspected it was you in the arena, I readied this. The Emperor must die. And he will. But we must save Rome first. I need you now, Marius. Fight for your father. Fight for your legion. Fight for Rome. Boudicca. Once her fate was in my hands, now she spearheaded the army of a thousand tribes. Their giant beasts of war bore down on our gates. The evils of a rotten empire visited upon its capital. We must all answer for our choices, Nero, but it's the people of Rome that now pay for yours. Ah, uh, Boudicca. Your fight was not with Rome itself but with Nero, who had our fathers murdered, and we will be avenged. But if Rome falls, then our world will descend into darkness. Chaos will lay waste to civilization. I will never let that happen. Our city defenses will funnel the bastards down into this one square. They could outnumber us by a thousand to one here, but confined space will take away that advantage. And, God's be willing, Rome will see another dawn. Here they come.
Hold steady. Hold steady. So I'm actually still recording from the previous session. So, uh, I'm gonna insert a jump cut here. And then next time, I'll pick up right here. But for you guys, it's just going to be a bleep. Focus on the targets as I follow my lead. Okay. Firing at. Paris, you'll find our archers more effective against large groups than individual units. How about these guys over here? Kind of don't need to. Do they? they bring in the war elements. You must focus on fire on them. They need archers. Fire boys. We can't reach that target right now, sir. Oh, I got it. Oh, hey. I don't even know what an elephant is to be able to say that. Warriors, Marius! Kill them! And lift the spirit of our defense! Marches on the far end! Do you mind, buddy? Oh, I don't think he enjoyed that very much. Focus on the office, it just off the top of my head. Thanks anyway. War nope. Keep firing! Keep firing! No one there. I feel bad for this 
irrelevant. Archers, they're on the right! Our line cannot hold much longer! Problem solved. I need every man we can spare. No, I will lead the charge. You'll never make it back. I can hardly let you have all the glory now, can I? Hmm. Well, then die well, Vitalian. Throw up the horns and be a hero. off already. Sir, the fourth cohort reserve has assembled, but our lines have broken. We have raiding parties operating throughout the city. Understood. Well, that's just prime. Oh, a real soldier. Fight. Oh. Oh, balls. Oh. Ow. 
very dramatic with that lighting. Oh, fuck. Ah, oh, god damn it. Oh, fuck. Third bit I missed. If you notice, that going toe to toe with these guys seems to be a poor choice. Oh, yeah, yeah, he had that one well in the bag. You were a good dancing partner. Shame we could only do it once. Oh, leader man through the forum. Fourth cohort. Yes, sir. Oh, they wrapped that up quickly. Oh god, I didn't think that would have worked. There's gotta be some goodies hidden here. I haven't found a scroll in it feels like four billion years. Ah! Speak of the devil, and he shall appear. Uh. Yeah, I thought so. Emperor Nero. Romans, Leontius, that brave and righteous, has died. You may have heard that it was bandits or barbarians who killed him, but it is not true. The real assassin, hiring those murderous thugs, is none other than our beloved Emperor Nero. He alone has been plotting for years to suppress reformers and free thinkers, murdering them if needs be. This is the time to fight for what we believe in, to fight for what our founding fathers built with so much work and sacrifice. If we do not fight, we will all soon be defenseless against Nero and his reign of terror, his Praetorians butchering us in our homes. Make a stand, people of Rome. Death to the tyrant! Hmm, I wonder if that guy was killed by Brighthons. Come on! This way! Surely we should go up there. Hmm, maybe not. I guess I have found a few too many things that there to be anything lying around up here, huh? That would be a good spot to... Where the fuck am I? Wow, I was actually going to say that would be a good spot to hide one of those Vista shields. Creepy. And that was the second scroll, apparently. We need to clear a way through. Vitalian is on the other side. 
Oh, you haven't died. My bad. Just be looting you for no reason. Someone really liked this uh, idea of out of the way areas that the player can sneak into. So which is it? The Scorpio or the other thing? I'm gonna do something that may be very well be very dumb. Call it a video. Yeah, I didn't like open a secret door or anything. But it might like blow all this stuff out of the way and then there'd be uh, treasure hidden behind it. Well, I'm Burning Dog Face and I'll see you in the next episode of Let's Play Rise, Son of Rome, when General Marius leads his men to uh, try and rescue Vitalian. And then we go about taking back this city one street at a time. Later!